<laughs> this is Rock Girl Jessica with FM 99. I am here with Five Finger Death Punch. They're getting ready to go on tonight. Would you like to introduce yourself? I'm Jason from Five Finger Death Punch. And? And I'm still Jason from Five Finger Death Punch. <laughs> what do you do in the band? Oh. <laughs> uh, I play guitar. And you're very good at it. Oh, thank you very much. A little bit humble. Okay, how long have you been with the band? Well, I came into the band uh, at the beginning of 2009. And I think that uh, they had already had Way of the Fist out, which was the first record. And then they ditched their original guitar player, and I came in to fill the place. And you do it well. Thank you. How do you like being on tour? Well, actually, you know, these days it's pretty good. Uh, I mean, we're spoiled. Uh, we all, each one of us has an assistant and our own dress rooms, and we have a masseuse. And no, are you lying? I'm not lying. <laughs> well, <laughs> we, you know, we kind of had this conversation a long time ago that being in a band and being on tour shouldn't suck. Another, it does when you start off, though, doesn't it? Well, the, it's hard to explain to the public, but there are, there are many micro frustrations that come with changing cities and changing buildings every day. Uh, just micro frustrations. These are not real problems. You know, like a, a brain tumor is a real problem. Uh, the air conditioning in the room every day, not a real problem. But it's frustrating. So, you know, if you don't know how to process all this change, it's constant change. If you don't know how to process it, it kind of can, can burn you out a little bit emotionally. But um, we fight through it. Okay, very well put. So what's your favorite thing to do on tour to like de-stress then? Because it is kind of stressful. Well, um, to be honest, I really enjoy playing the show. It's the best uh, 90 minutes of the day. Because the rest of it really is sitting around and waiting to play the show. I do maintain uh, that I do like to play my guitar. I mean, that's a really good answer. Yeah? <laughs> I don't know why it surprised me. Okay. Oh, so what do you do before? I mean, obviously you're here, you're doing meet and greets, you're hanging out with me. But what do you do right before you go on stage to get your, your, to get your mind right? You know what I mean? That's a good question. Um, I lift weights. Really? Yeah. Okay. How I, much I, do you lift? Well, it's not... You don't have to say. It's not really a... Um, you know, I'm not trying to break any records, but it, it serves a couple of purposes. Well, one is it kind of wakes me up. Mm -hmm. You know, it forces the blood to go <laughs> through your head and your body, which kind of brings me to, to life. And also, too, I mean, I got the Van Halen cranked and and do some curls, some push-ups, uh, do some shoulder, you know, flies. I mean, I just try to get the body awake, as awake as possible. I mean, I used to pound like energy drinks, um, but then the net result of that was that after the concert, having consumed six energy drinks, I couldn't fall asleep. <laughs> Understandably, right? Yeah, and it's already so, hard enough to sleep on a tour bus. I right, <laughs> it, it it was a disaster. So I switched to, uh, you know, I pick up the weights, I just fling them around and crank the music, and then I'm ready to go. I think it releases serotonin too, right? Yeah, it, it's all good. I mean, look, you, you know, your health is your wealth, and we're not, or at least I'm not, a young man anymore. I mean, this is a young man's game. You know, when you're 25, you can, you know, drink a 24 pack of beer and woohoo let's rock i'm not a young guy anymore so um it's really just about preservation and survival i mean i know that's not a romantic rock and roll answer no but, but you're keeping it real I, that's really, you'll be happy to know you don't look as old as you feel okay oh thanks well for <laughs> me it's all about like supplements vitamins uh, cardio weights i don't smoke i don't drink um Spent a lot of time on Pro Tools, the computer, stimulating my mind, read books, whatever. I mean, it's really just like we recognize that we are so freaking lucky to have broken through a, 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 a plateau that so many don't. Mm -mm. We are so lucky that we kind of look at it like we need to take care of ourselves so that we can continue to do this and to make people happy like keep it going yeah very you know? well because we've all had a back thing and a shoulder thing and a knee thing and and when and you realize you're not immortal you know that 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 if we want to um keep this alive we almost have to redirect our focus off of uh you know strip clubs and pool tables and and jack daniels to weights and supplements me too man that's just i mean that's just the truth <laughs> yes all right and i have one more question i know you're really busy so do you have a favorite song to perform for the audience 
Oh, um, yeah. I think I like, um, well, you know, they're all fun for different reasons, but I do like playing Coming Down because I get to go up on that hydraulic lift thing. And you guys won an award for that, correct? Um, I think we did. I don't remember. It might have been a huge award. I don't remember. Not that I'm not, <laughs> not, that I'm not grateful because mm -hmm. I'm grateful, but we have received so many awards. Yes, you have. And never expected to win anything. Yeah. You know? But we won best song, best new band, best rock this, best artist, platinum plaques, gold plaques. I mean, they're... We're, I mean, I never, we never really thought that you would lose track of your awards. But I can honestly tell you, I don't remember. It's but a good I think problem we, to have, I think I we think. did. <laughs> I'm grateful. Aww. But um, I get to ride the, the special effects lift thing, which you may or may not be aware of. Yes. But it's, uh, so that's why I like it. Because it, everyone takes their phone out and goes, holy crap. And it's a, it's a lot scarier on top of that thing than you would think. I look forward to it. Yeah, all right. <laughs> well, thank you for taking the time to see us. I know that you're very busy and you have a lot of stuff to do. Yeah, you're so, welcome. thank you. You're welcome.